Welcome back to Forever Simming. I want to talk about all the new stuff that came to The Sims 4 base game during the special delivery that came out February 9th and the new patch that just came out February 14th. Just as an FYI, if you don't know how to get these special deliveries in your game from the options menu, you can go ahead and go into game options and then go into Sims delivery. Please click automatically download unless you play with mods and CC, then definitely don't do that. A part of the special delivery, we got new carnival theme masks. This is separate from the kit that came out. We got a bunch of new robes in different colors that you can use for male and female sims. We also got a couple new bonnets, which I think is super cute and original. I really enjoyed it, especially for Black History Month. I usually play with people of color for my sims, so bonnets and do-rags are now part of the sims. Four. I wish the do-rag was a little bit longer in the back, but that's just me being picky. Not a big deal. They also included two new scenarios celebrating Carnival, which is time-sensitive, ends March 8th. And that one is basically just a kind of fun for all. They just want you to try out the new dishes. There's five new dishes that were included in the special delivery. And they want you to dance to the new radio station and have a party. Pretty simple. You can't really lose that objective because it's really easy. The second scenario, which is not time limited, is Power Couple. You start off with two young adult or older Sims and try to move them up in the business field. In addition, with the new patch that came out this week, we have a new lot type called Wedding Venue. So you can now pull it up in the gallery and search specifically for wedding venues. Just to give you an FYI, it is kind of broken right now. There's supposed to be another patch that comes out next week to fix it. So you can't actually use wedding venues. There has been some changes made to the wedding planning event. Even though the new pack is not out yet, it was delayed. They have changed the way you can plan weddings in The Sims 4. Then they also added new swatches to existing base game dresses for adults, for females and males, and also some clothing for children, teens, and toddlers. So I'm just going to go through really quick all the swatches. I think some of the dresses are pretty. I wouldn't necessarily consider them all wedding dresses. And some of the rainbow themed dresses are kind of too rainbow themed, if that makes sense. But I'm still excited to see that they're trying to make weddings more interesting than The Sims 4 and also make it for everyone. Whether you get the new pack that comes out on the 23rd or not, you can enjoy these dresses in game right now. Please note that if you do have mods or CC to remove those before you update with the new patch because that could wreck your game. I personally play with mods and so I had to disable them temporarily. Thanks for watching.